What's up, college football fans, sports fans, and fans of my channel? Guys, if you're new to my channel, please consider subscribing, liking, commenting, sharing, all that good stuff, baby. It really helps me out, helps the channel out, guys, helps me to grow into the Boss Nation. Thank y'all so much, so much, man, for coming back, watching all my videos from the beginning to the end. I love you guys, I love you. Y'all I got. Y'all I got, baby, y'all I got. And our uh, fam, this morning's video, man, you might as well say 3 o'clock in the morning. Man, this is about Emmanuel Henderson, five-star running back, baby. Five-star running back, guys, from Hartford, Alabama, Geneva County, and uh, Geneva County High School. And fam, from what I've seen from this running back right here, you know what? Before I just get into it, man, I'm just going to read y'all some stuff and whatnot. But anyway, fam, I am excited. I'm very excited, bro, because instead of the rich, Keep getting richer and whatnot. So, fam, look, let's just go over this um, this guy right here, this five-star running back right here, baby, from Alabama. Evaluated by Gabe Brooks, Midlands Region Recruiting Analyst, uh, analyst uh, with projection two to three round, day two. Um, comparisons, guys, to Wayne Gallman from the New York Giants. So, fam, already, man, they're comparing this guy to Wayne Gallman. I mean, yes, he has not done anything yet in college. Hell, he ain't got to college yet. But for him to be compared to Wayne Garman, man, that says something. That's already saying something. But anyway, let's, let's dive in. I just read a little bit about this guy, man. All right, taller, longer frame running back with lean athletic build that should foster ample bulk addition in college. Three-sport high school athlete who plays basketball and runs track, ran 11-40, as a sophomore, Dominant in football and hoops versus Alabama small school competition. Longer striding runner who shows good initial burst and downhill juice. Flashes dangerous cutback ability uh, will stack cuts on the same run. Always looking for as many extra yards as possible. In which, yes, as all the good running backs do. Impressively strings moves together at the second level. Considering longer high, high cut build. Simultaneously fluid and violent as a runner. Definitely got to be violent, baby. Definitely got to be violent. This plays good core strength and contact balance to extend runs, finishes runs consistently. That's the that, consistency, guys. Played, played snaps at running back, receiver, quarterback, and outside linebacker as a junior. Natural um, pass catcher and limited opportunities. Adequate top end speed. But still, um, still room to improve. Fam, forgive me, man. I, I wrote this. I wrote, I, I wrote like chicken scratch, guys. I cannot write. But anyway, um, still room to improve. Where is that at? Still room. Yeah, still room to improve. Potential in that category should be high giving frame slash gate. Gets bounce happy at times, which is likely at least in part to individual dominance versus small school competition. One of the nation's top backs in the 2022 class should become a high major impact player with a long-term NFL draft early round ceiling. All right, fam. So, for what I just read, man, on our running back on the 2022, seems like, man, you know what I'm saying? Seems like he's pretty legit, fam. Now, I will say this. Yes, he went to a smaller high school, 2A school, you know. So, the competition, man, it, it, it ain't like it would like be if it was like a 5A, you know, 6A, something like that. But fam, this is the running back position, man. You know, and um, I'm not for the, I'm not really for the judge him that hard, you know, just because I feel like there's always room to improve, baby. I don't care if he, even he did went to a five, six A school, man. You got a lot of kids going to five, six A, they don't, they don't pan out. So I feel like this, this guy right here, right now, is a five star. Yes, he dominates, fam. Dominates the 2A ranks. Dominates everything he does. Three sport athlete and whatnot. That's only going to help him. He don't play damn near every position, guys. Quarterback, outside linebacker. You know, all these positions, fam. You know, good at catching the ball. Violent as a runner. Um, consistent, consistently getting yards and whatnot. As many yards he can possibly get. So, fam, all of this right here, man, is going to play a big role and him being big time in Alabama, man. Yes, I know he's going to have a lot of competition to go up against. But, bro, it's only going to make the, the guys there already better. And it's only going to make him better. 
And who knows? He could come out, fam, and be the best running back, man, that we ever had, man. You know? Or at least one of the best running backs we ever had. So, fam, I am excited about this guy. I really am, man, because we need, we, we do, we need all the, all the help we can get, bro. You know, like I said, we still building our 2022 class, and it's nothing better to build them with than five stars, you know? Now, like I said, I know we had a couple five stars and then pan out, but this kid right here, bro, it remains to be seen, but for everything I don't read, and they all were comparing this kid to Wayne Gallman, fam, I don't see, I don't see how he, I don't see nothing bad about this guy. You know, he can, he can only going to help us. Not going to hurt us, fam. So I really think he's going to shine. He's going to do he's gonna do some big things at Bama, man. All he got to do is just get in that weight room, get bigger, get stronger, get faster. Because he has room to improve. He's going to keep improving. He's already a five-star at the high school level, man. So I can only imagine what he's going to do with Bama, especially getting out of that weight program, man, and giving those two um, scientists we have. David Ballou and whatnot, bro. He's gonna be a, he's gonna be even more of a beast. And mark my words, I know he went to a two A school, but I really think this guy's gonna show some stuff, bro. He he got something in him, you know, and it's gonna show, man. It's something special, and I feel like he's gonna do big things in Alabama, man. And we well we gonna see though, but I really feel like we got a good ass running back, bro. We got a good running back. Got a good quarterback in Ty Simpson. Yes, he went to a small school too. But if what I can see on that highlight tape, bro, he looks really, really good. So, fam, look, man, the sky's the limit for all our recruits uh, coming in. It's only going to make them better. Competition, you know, iron sharp as iron, baby. It's going to make them better. So, like I said, what do y'all think, though, bro? Do y'all think since he went to a 2 A school, do y'all think that with being, I don't know, man, you know, the competition's not that good. I don't know how he's going to do at Bama. I don't think he's going to do good. Or do you think that, hey, just because he went to a 2 edge school don't mean he can't come to Bama and, and, and do good, you know? Don't mean he can't, doesn't mean he can't come to Bama and shine. What do y'all think, fam? What do y'all think? Because like I said, bro, this is 2022, man. You know, this is another year away and whatnot. So he's still going to have room. It's still got time to improve now. And he's only going to get better and better and better, fam. You know, so... What do y'all think, man? What do y'all think? You think we got one? You think, you think we got us one big dog? Let me know in the comment section, fam. And women. Let me know in the comment section. What do you think about Emmanuel Henderson, man? You think he's gonna make um you think he's gonna do big things in Alabama? Or um, you know what I'm saying? You think he's probably gonna be tested a lot? Just let me know, bro. But anyway, man, look, this includes my video, fam. Like I said, all my videos. I love college football. You love college football. We love college football. And fam, with that being said, much love. Much love, guys. And uh, stay tuned. Stay blessed. I promise you. I'll be back with more videos. All right, peace.